Hello everyone and welcome back to Besiege. Now normally when I play Besiege, I'll take a bunch of different vehicles and I'll show you them and then I'll try and build something myself usually. But today, the only thing I'm going to do is focus on one build. But it's kind of a complicated build. It's kind of an idea that I've come up with. Uh, I kind of took some inspiration for some, from some things that you guys had mentioned such as, Hey Matt, you should make a blender in Besiege. Or, Hey Matt, you should uh, make an oven in Besiege. So I'm basically going to make a little kitchen and I'm going to eat some peasants. So uh, if that doesn't sound wonderful to you, then uh, what the hell's wrong with you? Or maybe what the hell's wrong with me for thinking that it's a wonderful idea. Let's do it. So the only thing I really know for sure is that we need to have some sort of robot person, okay? Now I was thinking maybe what we would do is uh, make a full robot, but that's totally not gonna work. We're gonna make a torso of a robot, okay? And he's gonna have a mouth, and he's gonna have uh, teeth of some sort, and he's gonna chew up these little peasants and he's gonna eat them, okay? It's going to be complicated, but I think we can make this work. Now, I've got some ideas when it comes to braces. I've been thinking about maybe using braces instead of having so many pieces of wood here. So you get more of a cinematic feel, so you can actually look and see what the hell is going on in there. So, uh, that may happen, okay? We're just going to take it one step at a time. It's one step up at a... I, I don't know what I just said. I have no idea what I'm currently building. I just know that it may or may not work. See, look, this is the head. This is the head so far. Okay, I don't know if it's gonna get down through that little hole down there. I'm hoping it will, okay, because the peasant has to fall into the stomach. If it doesn't fall into the stomach, you're not really eating a peasant now, are you? Okay, so uh, this thing currently works, okay? It can look down and break if you want it to. Or, you know, it can look up and, and break if, 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 if you want it to. Please tell me this will work. I'm really hoping this works here. Basically, put hinges in the back like this, okay? And then you can put the mouth out here like this, right? Now, it's going to limit his amount of... Shit, 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 he can't move now. He can kind of look forwards, but if he looks up, okay, he's going to break his neck. I don't know if we want this guy to break his neck. <laughs> it kind of already looks like a dude, even though that's not where his eyes are going to go. Okay, so you can look forwards. You, look, you can look back. Now, for the mouth, the mouth mechanics here, we need to put some more on here. I'm actually thinking we're going to need to move this thing up again, guys. Okay, we're going to need to move this thing up again. But I don't know if we can actually put teeth there, okay? But we can put some, like, bracers on there to look like teeth. Now, I'm starting to realize that this isn't exactly going to work, guys. Because if I got myself a thing right here, there's no hole for it to go down into the stomach. We need to keep that hole right there. That hole is really important. The most important hole you've ever seen. So now that'll still work, though, right? We just got to connect it in the back. Okay, so now we got it set to a different thing so that... Whoa, shit! Well, that's going to be a bit of a problem, isn't it? Okay, <laughs> so we got it set. So it's going to be able to look up and look down. And we gotta put the top of his head on yet. And he's actually got like a like a little mouth. Watch this. Nom 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 nom. Yes. Our plan is coming into fruition right now. He can actually eat. And he's got a hole, so the peasant can hopefully fall down into the hole. And especially if you close your mouth. If you close your mouth, you're gonna swallow and it's gonna go right down there. M maybe. I, I don't know. What do you guys think? You think the metal plates are good enough for eyes? Or should we like go crazy with it and put like blades on here? Some nice spinning blades to, you know, terrify our enemies. Can't, can't fit them. Okay, we're not putting blades. We can put gears. We could do gears if you wanted, okay? You can put a, put an unpowered cog in here. Those make some good eyes. Yeah, look at that. This guy looks terrifying, right? He wants to eat your soul. Look, watch. Oh, hey, run, run button, run button. Wait, he's got, shit. <laughs> this guy looks like he's seen some shit. And I like how his, his eyes are slowly rotating as well. Just just to make him look even better. Are you like falling backwards? I feel like you're falling backwards. You are one weird looking dude, but don't worry. Don't worry, we're not done with you, okay? We're not done with you yet. Just continue to pretend you're eating and uh, we'll get you straightened out soon enough. This guy's gonna be super complicated when he's done, but I do not care, okay? I do not give a shit, we're doing this. So we gotta make a steering joint here. Oh God, okay, this guy's never gonna work. He's gonna be so freaking complicated. We should probably just not even worry about this one. We should probably just pretend that this one does stuff when it actually doesn't and just use the right arm for everything. Everyone's got a dominant arm, okay? Don't all pretend you're ambidextrous, because you're not. What the hell do I have so far, guys? That is the question. Up and down, and we can move it like this. Oh, God. It's also controlling his mouth. That's not good. Your mouth just broke. Oh, Jesus, your face is breaking. But at least your eyes are spinning. That is fantastic, okay? We're putting you on America's Next Top Model, you beautiful bastard. You turn it, turn, turn, spin, do the, there we go, and you bring, oh crap, oh crap, my head fell off. This guy got into a terrible accident as a child, and they replaced his hand 
with a freaking spinny uh, circular saw of death, okay? That's what he has for his other hand, a circular saw. So don't fuck with him. Would you look at that, guys? Would you look at that? The grabber is going right in his mouth, which means that this part is complete and we have made something that can eat. So will you pull that away? Wait, wrong button. I don't know the buttons on this shit. Grab hold. There. Okay, you pull it away, and then he can uh, he can open his mouth. I got the, all these controls going on here, guys. It's kind of ridiculous, but he can open his mouth and he can chew now. Okay. Hopefully he can chew peasants, and hopefully they don't fall out the back. Okay. He's got a hole in his neck, but he'd appreciate it if you didn't make fun of him for it. Because some people were just born that way. Now I'm not sure how this works when it comes to actually having uh, bracers in places where normally there would be actual. Um, you know, supports, but I'm gonna put some bracers here so we can see his stomach. It's like a cage for peasants, where they're slowly digested by the mechanical juices of this robot. I don't know, I don't know, like, can he fall out of that? Not really sure, but it looks cool, look at that, look at, look at that, he's transparent now. Okay, now, so you guys are here, and, uh, I can't really do a whole lot about you. And, uh, I, I, don't, I don't really want to, because you guys always cause me a lot of trouble whenever I try and do anything with you. Can I just... There you go, I broke you. Oh, crap, I broke myself as well. I might need to put invincible mode on, okay? Now, like I said, guys, I want to kill peasants, okay? Because the knights, the knights are just, they're just annoying, okay? They run at you and they do all kinds of crap you don't want them to do. Peasants, I find peasants are really, they're really mild-mannered. They don't want to hurt you. They just want to run away in fear. And when they try and run away in fear, fear we'll just, we'll just we'll walk over, we'll drive over, and we'll kill them, okay? We'll brutally murder them, and then we'll eat them. Okay, so we're making these things kind of simple. We don't want to go too crazy with our blender design. We also need to find a way to get the guy out of the blender after we put him in there. Now, you know, it's a food processing unit, of course. So we'll, we're going to put him in like that, okay? And then we're going to have some bracers on the side, which hopefully uh, don't cause us any problems. And we got to make some pistons so it lifts up and lifts the guy out. I don't know what's going to happen with this vehicle, okay? Or whatever you want to call it. This little build that I'm trying. But basically, the point is, I want this guy... To not fall out, I want him to get blended up. I'm not even sure how uh, bracers work when it comes to people, okay? Don't even matter to me. Don't even matter. Ah, oh, it works! Look at that! It's gonna lift up, and the guy's gonna fall out. We're gonna pick him up, we're gonna eat him, okay? So that's done, and now we just need to build ourselves an oven to go with it. Put the oven on the other side, of course, okay? Now it's gotta be, it's gotta obviously be made with metal, guys. You can't have an oven that's not made of metal, because it's gonna burn up. Okay, now there's a little there's a little thing in this. We can actually use one of the new weapons, okay? They have a little torch now, apparently. Small torch. Look at that! Now does that burn? Does that burn if I put this here? Oh, what happened? Sorry about your house breaking on you, or whatever. I don't know how to make a torch burn, guys. Maybe, let's just, let's just see. We gotta make sure it actually works first, because there's no point in doing this crap if it doesn't actually burn. It burns! Yes! Okay, we are in business, ladies and gentlemen. Now... Now we make ourselves shit an oven. Undo one. We need this. Okay. Okay. The oven is passing the will it burn test, guys. It is not burning, which is good. We don't want the oven to burn. Now we just need to put something up above it. Could we use, like, could we use bracers as, like, a grating for the oven? I'm not really sure. But we're gonna try it. Okay. First of all, we gotta make the oven a little bit bigger. And we gotta, like, put a top on it and stuff. Because that's what ovens do. They have tops. Okay, guys. I think we're actually gonna go with more of, like, a barbecue grill. Does this look like a barbecue grill to you? It looks like a barbecue grill to me. We just need to make sure that our bracers are nice and, uh, and, uh, covering everything so they don't fall in. I'm assuming. I don't even know. This is, the, the worst thing about this is I'm not even sure. I haven't really tested to see if the peasants fall through these bracers or not. But I'm thinking they won't. Okay. So there you go. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. Okay, guys. I've decided to make this guy's eyes spin automatically because I think that looks super badass. Doesn't that look more threatening to you to have some guy walk, like, rolling towards you with spinny eyes? He's got a blender over here and a barbecue grill over here. This is going to be a great day. Okay, guys, I think the time has finally come. We're going to try this out. We're going to bring it down like this, okay? Bring it down. I'm going to drive him forwards, okay? Everybody calm down. It's going to work. Oh, he's running away this time. Get back here, peasant. Don't you dare walk into that bomb. You didn't. Good boy. Good. You've been a good boy. To turn over here go towards you come on oh ah I'm touching you what the hell yes I got him I got him and he's dead he is dead okay he looks really happy for a dead guy that's fine that's not a big deal look at him look at him what's his name Gilbert or Benedict one of the two you might be both of them because I know this game is a bit weird we gotta back up Gilbert Benedict the second 
Feel like feel like he should be the second, because Gilbert Benedict sounds like a pretty fancy name. Okay. So we gotta spin you around. I'll spin you right round, baby. Right round like a record, baby. Gonna bring you over here now. Okay, we gotta cook you up. No, we gotta we gotta process you in our food processor first before we put you on the grill. You don't put dirty meat on the grill, okay? You process it first. I'm gonna bring you forwards, mister. Mr. Gilbert Benedict. We're gonna drop you off down here. Yeah, you ready? Go! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, and he doesn't come out because of the freaking things there. Oh he came out anyway. He he came out anyway. It's fine. It's fine. Pretend that didn't happen. Doesn't matter. Still looks great. Still look pretty damn great. Now, we're gonna bring him down. Bring it. Wait! Wait, no! No, our torches went out! You son of a bitch! How dare you! We were gonna we were gonna grill you, okay? Jesus Christ! Okay, well we're gonna drop you off anyway. We apparently we fucked up guys. We fucked up a lot. Because this guy's not being grilled like he should be. That that bothers me. That that really bothers me. Well, crap. Okay, guys. Unfortunately, we can't use the torches, you know. So we're gonna use flamethrowers instead. It should be fine. Okay, I'm pretty sure flamethrowers can go one by one. There we go. It'll stay on top. The peasant will get roasted. Everything's gonna be fine. Nobody's gonna cry. Please don't cry. It's it's cool. So now we can turn them on and off with why? Yeah, look at that. Now that is what I call a barbecue grill, guys. Okay. Jesus Christ. Just gonna drop you off here. Don't fall down through the cracks because that'd be really annoying. I'm gonna reach in there and grab you. I'm not in the mood to do that, okay? Just just give me a second. It's really hard to drive this thing, and we'll drop you off. There. Shit! You're moving everything, you bastard! Look at you in there! Look at you just curl up in a ball in there! That's not what I wanted! Look! He knocked them all over! Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Okay. I knew it was too good to be true, okay? I knew I had this done too good to be true. There. Now. Put the top on, put the grill on, and shut the hell up. It's gonna work this time. Oh, shit, shit. Oh, the defense mechanisms are coming up. They don't want me to kill them. Go, I'm gonna get them anyway. Or not. Go around the corner, I'll meet you on the other side, buddy. Are you telling me I can't get under this thing? Are you really, you know what, you can You can survive. I don't care. I'm soon gonna just grab a chicken to cook with it as well, because there's chicken here. Bet the chicken's not gonna run away like a fucking idiot. Probably will, I don't know. Can we get it? We got a chicken. We got a chicken, buddy. Okay. Forget about you. We're cooking this guy with a nice, delicious... Where the hell did it go? Where the hell did the chicken go? Oh, damn it. Okay, we are cooking you, then. Maybe I should just roast you like this. Maybe you should. Maybe I should roast you like a marshmallow. Maybe that's what I should do. Would that be an easier task for me? It certainly would be. Look, let's do it. Boom. Roasting you like a freaking marshmallow. Great. Now, can we also drop you there? You fell off the grill. You're, you're the worst, you're the worst meal I'm, I'm ever gonna eat. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna grab your friend real quick and get him as well. Okay, it's important. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys. I'm stuck. There's a bracer attached to me for some reason. Please get off. Okay, you're coming with me. You're coming with me. I'm not, I'm not losing this battle here. I'm not doing this with you today. Please, please don't. Please, no, no, stop. Stop, you're hurting my feelings. Okay, guys, this right here is what I call bullshit. I don't, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, but we're gonna do it one more time, okay? This time we're gonna eat the peasant. Okay, you're dead. That's step one. You're picked up. That's step two. You're going in my blender. That's step three. There you go. Now you're going on my barbecue grill. I'm actually gonna drop him off this time, guys. Here we go. Okay, so we uh, start up the grill with Y. Drop him off with V. Allow him to cook for six to eight minutes. Or, you know... That should be long enough here. He actually stayed on there this time. Look, it actually looks like a real grill. Stop spinning around, okay? This ain't breakdance class. Okay, this is this is I kill you class. And now, ladies and gentlemen, after all that is done, I present to you the eating of the peasant. I don't even remember what buttons his mouth. Okay, I got his mouth. His mouth is right here. Okay, now let's try and figure this out. Lift it up. We got uh, we got a spin. Okay, that's spin th this way like this. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool. That's cool. We also got another one. There's another one that spins. There, that turns as well. Oh, bring it, bring it back out. You're going too far now. You go, Jesus. Where? Stop. Okay, okay. I got, I got this. We just need to turn it in. Look at that. Look at that. He's in the mouth. Okay. He's in the mouth. Just move him in a little bit. There we go. Okay. Now we gotta chew him. We gotta chew him before we, before we do anything else. Oh yeah, that's some good peasant right there. That is some delicious peasant. Now we gotta drop him off and hope he doesn't, he doesn't fall out. We gotta move him in a bit first. That's probably a better idea. Move him in. There you go. There you go. Move. Turn, turn a little bit. Just look there. Okay. And drop him off. He's ready to be consumed. 
Go, 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 peasant. Go, peasant. It's your birthday. Yeah, yeah. Oh, crap. He's falling out. He's falling out. We need to, we need to move uh, this up. Go up. In, in, go in. Yes. Yes, the... Son of a bitch. Hang on. We got this. We got this. Let go of that. Fall down. Oh, and the peasant is in the stomach. Eh, he rolled out. He, he rolled out of the stomach, but it's, it's fine. He was in there. He was in there for a minute, guys. If bracers worked the way I'd like them to in reality, where they're actually physical objects, this would have been a whole lot cooler. But it's okay. Okay, look, look at this guy. He is super happy. He's, he's got a bloody eye, okay? He gave himself pink eye because he went through so much shit. And that, guys, is where I'm going to end this video. So thank you so much for watching this episode of Besiege. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.